Y'all, I got hungry, so I opened me some chips. If y'all don't tell, I won't tell. Oh my God, it's so good. <laughs> Look at that. Mm. Hey guys, welcome back to another vlog. We is back with another vlog. So I just got off of work, y'all. Right now, I am on my way to the grocery store because I have not gotten groceries, y'all, in probably like over a month. So I'ma um, show y'all what I got from the grocery store or what I'm gonna get from the grocery store. And I actually have this light on while I'm driving right now, y'all. So I just wanted to do my little intro, but I'ma see y'all when I actually get to um, Walmart. If y'all don't know already, I do my grocery shopping at Walmart. So I see y'all when I get there. Y'all, we just got to the market, right? And y'all, tell me why my stomach start to bubble, man. Like, <laughs> I'm like, oh my gosh, man. Lord, please bear with me at least until I get home. <laughs> First of all, y'all, I get all these bags because I be getting a lot of protein. I mean, produce. And um, people are already looking at me weird, y'all. Oh my God, they already looking at me like, where's that girl doing talking to the camera? But I don't care, I don't care. <laughs> so I'm about to get me some lemons. What else is over here? Avocado, some lime. I don't see nothing else right now over here. And then I'm gonna get me a pineapple, y'all. But I always forget to cut my pineapple up and it always go bad. So fingers crossed that I remember, y'all. Make sure y'all remind me to cut my pineapple because I be forgetting. And baby, we can't be forgetting that pineapple, baby. So let's go ahead and get our um, produce real quick, y'all. And then I'm gonna take y'all to the next section on what I'm gonna get. Um, Cause we on a budget. This, this <laughs> baby, we on a budget. So this gonna be a on a budget. Um, Grocery haul, bet. <laughs> You'll never find like a love like. <laughs> Y'all, we gotta get some bananas. I try to get some small bananas because I don't be liking them big bananas. I feel like something wrong if they that damn big. But I try to get them where they not that that yellow. I like to eat them when they got brown spots on there, but um, I don't want them to go bad too fast. So we're gonna get them while they're a little bit green. So, so far I got lemons, bananas, and pineapple. Y'all already know why I'm coming over here, right? I just wanted to show y'all real quick. Is it just me or did y'all used to eat these for y'all birthdays? Like, <laughs> These used to be the cakes for my birthday. I used to want one of these every single year. I ain't gonna get one though, cause you know, they, they dangerous. But y'all, I had to bring y'all over here to the Carver Cakes. If you don't know about Carver Cakes, baby, what is you doing? If you know, you know, I like to get these as well. Even though I'm getting lemons and limes, I still like to get these too. So I do wanna get some cilantro, cause I wanna make some fresh pico de gallo. Pico de gallo, so cilantro it is. This is my favorite spring mix to get, organic market side. And it only costs two dollars, y'all. I usually get two of them, but I'm gonna only get one right now. And then we also are gonna get a bag of spinach. If only a man was this, never mind. So I'm gonna get two cucumbers. No, I'm gonna get one because I be letting them go bad. So I'm just gonna start off with one. These are the tomatoes I like to get for my pico de gallo and for my salads. See, what is that furry stuff? Like that means it's going bad, don't it, y'all? Uh-uh. That's the only thing about coming to Walmart, y'all. They produce is not the best at all. And yup, I'm opening every one because I need to make sure. And I like to make sure they are firm. So this one is good. We're going to do this one. So I usually get the turkey one that's like this. The little, what is these called? Whatever these called. But they don't got the turkey one, y'all. I'm real mad. I guess I can try this one. The butterball. I don't know if I'm going to like that. I feel like the butterball be having more sodium or something. I don't know. I guess I'll try it. Oh, hey, <laughs> I play too much, y'all. So anyway, I'm gonna give me some shrimp now. I'm gonna try not to get no meat this time, y'all. I got chicken already at home, but I'm trying to cut back on meat. We're gonna do two of these, or should we do three? They only $5. We're just gonna do two for now. 
And then we gonna see if they got some salmon. Nine dollars for this little tiny salmon. Oh no, they getting over. Hold on, y'all, cause they should have one that's cheaper than that. <laughs> Maybe I should get a big one and cut it in half. That'd be smart, right? Ooh, it's <laughs> we gonna do this one. It costs $10, but by the time you cut this in half, you got about two. So we gonna put that up there. We don't want that down there with the, um, we don't want that touching the produce. You know what I'm saying? That fish juice all dripping on your apples and shit. We ain't doing that. That's ghetto. I'm gonna also get me some whiting. If you eat tilapia and you ain't eating whiting, what is you doing? Like, why is y'all still eating tilapia? Like, ain't nobody eating no tilapia? <laughs> Usually I get the little bag, but it look like they only got the big bag. So I guess we're gonna do this one. Dang, I ain't want this big ass bag though. But I guess we're gonna do this one, y'all. <laughs> no meats this time, y'all. <laughs> nah, it's cool. I'm gonna see how long I can go without eating some chicken. So I'm gonna do some eggs. I usually do, let me show y'all which ones I get. So these are the eggs that I get, the 12 count. I usually get um the two dozen or the dozen and a half but they don't got none right now so of course you got to make sure your eggs is good i usually get those two but since they got the organic ones i'm just gonna get the organic and y'all i know my hands is ashy so shut up don't be trying to joke me so if y'all know y'all know i get the carry gold butter they actually have the gold one this time which is the one that i prefer the white one or the silver one this one this one is unsalted so if you want to do unsalted, you can do that one. But otherwise, I get the gold one. These are so good. Oh my gosh. But I wish they had them in um, unsweet or plain. This is the vanilla one. And this is by Silk. So good. So I'm going to do two of these. So I guess these are going to be the Christmas cookies, y'all. Because these are the only ones they got. I don't see no other ones. This is all the rest of them. So we're going to get these. I also want to get some frozen strawberries um because sometimes my strawberries go bad y'all i'm getting these for my smoothies and i'm gonna also get me some peaches we're gonna do these too if y'all really be watching me y'all know i love this broccoli okay so we're gonna get two because i already got a lot at home We almost done. Ooh, I should get these, y'all. These is so good. The Core Life um, protein. I'm gonna do these. I wonder how much they cost. These are so good, y'all. So these bars right here are good protein bars, but y'all, look how much they cost. Six dollars and forty-eight cent for only four. I'm gonna grab them, but if I go over my limit, they going back. Can I make it? Can I make it? Oh shit, I still didn't make it. I suck. That's why I ain't play sports in school. If you know, you know. Y'all, I got hungry, so I opened me some chips. If y'all don't tell, I won't tell. Oh, I need to get some tuna fish. So y'all, this is the coffee cups that I used to use, but I don't want to pay $14. Like, I don't know. I might just continue getting the ones out of my renter's office. <laughs> I don't know, y'all. I'ma just get this one. Of course, I gotta get me some green tea with a lemon. If you know, you know, this is my favorite tuna, y'all. So I'm gonna get about five of these. Oh, can we get it out? Can we get it out? So the last thing I gotta get is some water. Then after that, I am done. I didn't get no snacks because y'all, this is crunch time, okay? I know I told y'all I was trying to lose weight, but y'all, I, 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 I didn't cheat it. I didn't cheat it, y'all. But this go around, we are gonna do good, so. Let me get the water real quick. All right, y'all. It's time to go check out. What's up, y'all? We is back at the crib. I put all the groceries away. I showed y'all everything I got. Literally everything I showed y'all is everything I got. So before we go, I can't just leave y'all with just a grocery haul. We gotta cook something, right? <laughs> so I figured why not just show y'all like a simple meal, but still good, you know what I'm saying? Cause I don't really cook a lot on my channel. I'm gonna start cooking a little bit more y'all. Actually, let me show y'all what I got real quick. If y'all know, y'all know, look what I got. Can y'all see? Baby, when I tell you this cookbook, 
I ain't even cooked nothing out of there yet. So look at all y'all. It's so many recipes in here, y'all. So let me know in the comments below if y'all want me to do like cooking videos, cause I do know how to cook. Okay, so I got the Jai Nice or Jay Nice. If y'all know her, follow her on Instagram, y'all. She be throwing it, y'all. She be throwing it down on the ground. <laughs> so anyway, I had this cookbook for a while, but. We're not using this today, but it's so many recipes in there. It's drink recipes. Girl, it's so much stuff in there. So, y'all let me know if y'all want me to do, like, cookie videos sometimes. I can do that. You know what I'm saying? Because I be... <laughs> Look at it. Look at it. Look at it. <laughs> so, tonight, we are going to make some shrimp. I feel like I always show y'all shrimp. But I, I told y'all I'm not eating chicken this month. So, we're doing shrimp. We're doing cauliflower rice, and we're going to throw in, I'm thinking, um, let me see if my heavy whipping cream is expired. It's probably expired. Ooh, my heavy whipping cream is not expired, y'all. So this is what we're going to make. This is what we're going to make. This is what we're going to make. <laughs> I'm excited now. So we're going to do shrimp with homemade, homemade Alfredo, the sauce. Okay, I'm going to whip that up. I'm going to show y'all. With cauliflower rice. Hold on, I ain't done. I ain't done. And then we gonna throw some peppers up in there. Y'all, this is about to be good. This is about to be good. So I'm ready to cook. I feel like I'm talking too much. Let's just get straight into it. Let's get the ingredients out. Let's get this thing busting and popping. And let's and don't be acting like I ain't put y'all on when y'all see this meal, because this meal about to be fire. Not fire, fire. <laughs> All right, y'all, so since my shrimp is not completely thawed out, I'm going to hurry up and take out what I need only for this meal, and this is going back in the freezer. This is like lukewarm water, y'all. We only need about, mm, that's enough. That's good. And then, of course, you know, you have to clean your shrimp, okay? I don't know how y'all clean y'all's, but we use vinegar around here. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to let that sit for a few minutes and work on our other ingredients. So now I'm going to go ahead and work on the sauce and the peppers. I actually want to put some spinach in here as well. So let me get some olive oil real quick. All right. So we're going to put a little bit of olive oil in the pan. Just like that. Then we are going to add a little bit of peppers in here so we can kind of saute the peppers. I wish I had some mushroom, y'all, because I will put some mushroom in here too, but... I don't have no mushroom right now, but you can add mushroom in here. I like a lot of peppers and stuff, y'all. I'm sorry. So while the peppers are sauteing, we're just going to throw these in the microwave really quick for five minutes. I am going to add a little bit of garlic in here as well. All right, y'all. So let's just add some garlic. So I cleaned my shrimp, I also cleaned my hands already, and I patted them dry with a paper towel. So it's only about six shrimp, six, seven shrimp. We're going to pour some olive oil in here and get these seasoned so that we can also get them put in the pan as well. Not a lot of olive oil, y'all. Just a little bit. Just a little drizzle, drizzle, because we don't have that many. So now we're going to add our seasoning. I'm doing obey, of course. Got to put obey on the seafood, y'all. You got to have obey, y'all. I'm actually running low, so I'm kind of mad because I just went to the market, but it's cool. I get some more. Then you got to add your garlic powder, not garlic salt. We don't do that salty stuff around here, y'all. Okay. A little bit of pepper. Like that. I also like to put Italian seasoning on it. Just a little bit, not that much. And then, of course, some parsley. Usually, you put parsley at it on it at the end, but... It's fine. It's not going to do nothing. Y'all already know parsley is just for it to look cute. <laughs> and then you're just going to roll it around, y'all. Okay. Please make sure your hands is clean, boo. Please. And some people may feel like my food is not seasoned enough. That's a, that is fine as well. <laughs> That's good enough for me. So let's go ahead and start cooking them. So we're actually going to add the shrimp to this pot that has the um, garlic... A little bit of olive oil already in there and then the peppers so let's just put the shrimp in there with that so i'm only going to pour a little bit in this bowl because this is a bowl i'm going to use to eat out of and i'll save the rest of the cauliflower for another meal by the way this is already seasoned so you do not need all that extra seasoning y'all that should be enough i am going to add a little bit of pepper though 
All right, y'all. So I'm gonna put a little bit of lemon juice in here and a piece of butter as well. Give it some extra flavor, you know what I'm saying? Some juices to roll around in. And I'm about to show y'all how my cauliflower look. I'm gonna add that in here as well. All right, y'all, so my shrimp is looking pretty good. I wish I had a little bit more um, Obey, but it's fine. Uh, they look pretty good to me. So I'm just gonna add the cauliflower rice to the pan so that it can kind of like, you know, cook all together. Cause it's gonna be so good, y'all. All these flavors together is gonna be so good. And then I'm gonna show y'all how to make the sauce after this. Roll it around, get it all mixed up in them juices. Ooh, yes, yes, yes. All right, before we actually start making our sauce, we're gonna put a little bit of um, spinach in there. And I'm gonna put a top on there so it can kind of cook a little faster. So my food is done. I'm about to just make the sauce to pour on top. So I'm just using a little bit of grass-fed butter. I usually put Obey in here when I make it, but I don't have any Obey, so I'm just gonna have to use some Mrs. Dash. But I will usually do Obey. Of course, you already know, you gotta add some garlic. Now this is not gonna be a lot of sauce, y'all. You will usually use more butter, of course, but this is not a lot of sauce that I'm making, so I'm only using a little bit. I'm gonna go ahead and pour in, that's all I need, just a little bit y'all, not a lot, because I don't want a lot of sauce. So, that was um, heavy whipping cream. Okay, you see how it's bubbling already y'all? That's how we want it to do, okay? And then we're gonna put some cheese. Like I said, I would usually use Obey, but I don't have Obey, so this is some Mrs. Dash that I'm using. Garlic powder, Italian seasoning, and parsley flakes. Ooh, that look good. All right, so we just gonna stir it up. It's already almost done, y'all. This is simple. I will not buy um, store-bought Alfredo ever again in my life. Ooh, don't it look good, y'all? So now what we gonna do is turn it down low, cause it's already done, y'all. And we gonna add our, um, you know our food in here so it can kind of mix all together oh my gosh it's gonna be so good i turned the heat down i told y'all my pots be cooking way too fast but look at that y'all don't that look good don't that look good oh my oh my god your girl is a chef it probably don't look as good y'all but I promise you, this is so good, y'all. And you can add more spinach, of course. Y'all know spinach, it don't even cook down to nothing. So this is done. I don't want it to burn, so let me take it off. All right, y'all, so this is the finishing touches. And you got so many vegetables in here. You got cauliflower rice, peppers, onions, parsley, spinach. And then, of course, you have your shrimp for protein. The only thing that's really bad that I used, y'all, was cheese and the fact that I used um, heavy whipping cream. But this is my dinner. So that is it. It's still hot right now. I already know it tastes good, though. I already know it tastes good because I made this before. Only thing I did different, like I said, was the Obey. Y'all, I just want to taste it just, just while I was on camera with y'all. Because this, this is like one of my favorite things to make, y'all. And it's so healthy. Girl! Baby, if y'all try this, oh my God, it's so good. It's so good, y'all. Look at that. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. That ain't hot, y'all. Mmm. I got my probiotic right here. Probiotic kombucha. Mmm. Anyway, y'all, that's the end of this vlog. Thank y'all for coming. Grocery shopping with me. We call it the market from Baltimore. It's going to the market, but we're going to call it grocery shopping. And also, y'all stuck around and made some dinner with me, y'all. <laughs> So I will see y'all in tomorrow's vlog. Peace.